Your Minecraft is running like this. Let's fix it. First of all, if you are not using Optifine, then you need to install Optifine to make the game more smoother. So to install Optifine, first of all, open any browser and then search Optifine. For the version you need, just click on download and your Minecraft version and wait 5 seconds, skip, download. After downloading it, open it double click on it and uh, ok and this thing will be pop up just click on install and optifine is successfully installed open your minecraft launcher and in the version section just select optifine and your version and click on play ok after the game gets opened after installing optifine just go on options video setting and do some settings like follow me first if you have a mid end pc and if you have a graphic card then do it to 8 and if you don't have a graphic card then do it to 4 but if you want to see more further you can increase it more as you like just do it 4 if you have a low end pc and uh, simulation distance 5 graphics fast smooth lightning off smooth lightning off details clouds off trees to fast rain and snow fast fog off entity distance most important you can turn this to 50 if you have a low end pc but if you have a mid end pc then 100 but i will recommend if you have a low end pc then 50 biome blend off go in animations and if you have a really low end pc or a low end pc then click on all off after that all animations will be turned off and game will run smoother and click on done and then performance turn on smart animations smooth fps fast render fast math and render region turn these things on and uh, chunk updates one lazy chunks loading off quality if you have a low end pc then turn off mip map levels off nearest mip map type anti aliasing off and this thing doesn't give a impact on your fps in game so just click on done and done and done and now you can check your game is running smooth or not but if it's still lagging let me help you more quit the game go on your task manager from here turn off the useless app which you don't want to get start at uh, startup as you can see i have already done it and an important thing if you use google chrome then in here you can see google chrome using your 60 percent or 50 percent cpu gpu or anything so just if you use google chrome i will never recommend you to use google chrome just use another browser but if you want to still use google chrome so every time you want to play games just come in task manager and just click on google chrome and end task because it will use 60 to 50 percent of your cpu and it will be huge impact on your uh, fps so yeah after doing this things still your game is lagging so you need to check your system tray and close useless apps like epic games and the useless app which you don't want here to run at your background just close it and after doing this still your game is not giving you fps it can cause by discord because discord use your pc resources too much because of that your game can't run properly so if you don't use or talk with discord but it's still running in your background just go on system tray and quit discord and it will give you a good boost of fps but if you have a low end pc and you still want to talk to your friends while playing games you so can you can use discord in your browser just go on your browser and search discord after searching discord just click on the first link open discord in your browser just do this and just log in your account and you are good to go if you have a low end pc then don't use discord app because this will use more cpu usage or resources too much that the game can't run smoother so don't use discord app if you have a low end pc just use it in your browser 
I know the video will be a little longer but it will be worth it. After doing this thing still your game is not running smoothly just search choose a power plan. After opening this you can select high performance if you have a PC then you can use high performance but if you have a laptop then this high performance thing will take more energy from your PC. So if you have a PC then I will recommend you to use this high performance thing but you can do this at your own risk. It can maybe damage your PC parts if your PC gets too hot. And if you already did that and still it's not working you can use this unlimited performance thing. If you don't know how to unlock this I will show you. Just search powershell and run as administrator. Oh yes and just paste this thing in here and just press enter this code i will give you in description on top or maybe bottom just check it out and you are good to go and one more thing if you use lunar client or other clients don't use it because clients can be more resourceful thing and it can cause more laggy gameplay experience so don't use clients just use minecraft launcher or the game will be more laggy because of clients after doing this much thing still your game is not running properly you can use more mods to make the game smoother not optifine you can use other mods like sodium and more mods which i will tell you in this video i know the video will be a bit longer but it will be worth it so the first mod you are going to download is sodium so first go on your browser and search sodium mod minecraft and your game version go on the first site and from here select your version down from here and just save it next mod we are going to download is fabric installer just search this and go to the first site and download for windows and download it the and next mod we want to download is fabric api just uh, select your version after going in files this is my version just download it i'm doing it for minecraft 120.1 you can do it for any other version just save it the next mod we are going to download is lithium the first side and just go in files and select your version and just click on download and wait 5 seconds and it will, will automatically download then the next mod we are going to download is starlight so just search starlight mod in the first side the same procedure and the next mod we are going to download is reso sodium options just go on the first side files and remember to see the mod loaders if it's forged then don't download it you need to download it for fabric please keep this in mind that we are downloading the mods for fabric not for forge select your version click on download and the next mod you are going to download is sodm extra 120.1 fabric just go on the first side select your version download and save it and the last mod we are going to download is mod menu and just download it from the first site after downloading all the mods just go on the location where you downloaded it and just double click fabric installer after doing that you need to just select your game version and nothing else just click install and the loader will do the things and successfully install just close the installer and just copy this all the mods and just copy it and search percentage app data percentage and open it and go on minecraft mods just paste it here and just close this now just go on version selector and select fabric loader 1.20.1 the version you install the name it gets after selecting the fabric loader just click on play and after that some things will download small files and the game will launch i can guarantee you that it will increase 10 to 30 fps or more of your game as you can see the mods are running properly and the game has been launched and you can see this mods option you can see which mods are installed in your game as you can see 
just click on done and just go on video setting in this you can customize more things if you have a low-end pc so now you can customize more your game so your game will be be less laggy like the render option if you have too much item frames the item frames are entity actually so game will be laggy so just uh, untick the item frame in particles you can select a every single particles in the game and you can uncheck which you want and which you don't want so it can increase your fps also as you can see every single particle you can customize it more as you like and i hope your game gets smoother and you will get more fps i can guarantee you it will increase 10 to 20 fps of your game but it can increase up to 60 or 80 fps as you can see my game is running at uh, 370 80 fps and it's a pretty good fps for a game like minecraft before doing these things my game was running at 300 fps and now it's giving me 80 fps or 90 or 100 fps more after doing these things now play the game more smooth and uh, enjoy the game experience but after doing this much things still your game is not running properly you can do the last thing go on options video setting full screen resolution turn it to 720p this is 720p after doing that the game will run at 720p and game will be run more smoother changing resolution can give the biggest impact to your fps in game now you can see my game is running at 800 fps and it's more than i want so i'm back at my normal resolution i hope this video helps you if it does please give this video a like and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe this video has taken lot of knowledge and complicated things which we did to make you a simple video so i hope that you will like this video subscribe and comment down below if you have any problem you can comment down below and tell me but if you want to solve it urgently you can just join my discord server link in the description and you can contact me right there i will meet you on another video like this bye bye